Hey, how's it going everyone? Today I'd like to show you a very nice browser. It's called Qt Browser and it has Vim-like key bindings. If you are on Arch Linux, you can find it on the repositories. Just type pacman and then Qt. You can install it by sudo pacman dash s and then Qt Browser. I'm going to show you this version, so 0 0.10, okay? And I have to say that if you have problems, for example, uh, with YouTube or some other videos, you can try this option, so backend web engine. And there is also a man page, so man cute browser, if you want to check some other options. There is also another backend, you can try that if you have problems. All right, I'm going to launch it. And as you can see, it opens right now on DataGo. And uh, by the way, you can use the mouse, you know, as with any other browser. Or you can also use the keyboard. By the way, it's a Vim-like browser, so you probably, you are interested with using it with the keyboard, you know. For example, I just opened this link here, which contains some information about DataGo. You can do the same by pressing F. And then, as you can see here, to go here, you have to press D. So I'm going to press D, okay? And as you can see, it's just the same as uh, as pressing with your uh, your mouse, you know? And I can go back by pressing capital H. So Shift H, and I can go back. I can go forward, Shift L, okay? Okay, let's search something. As you can see now, I can, I'm pressing some buttons, but it's not working because I'm not in insert mode. So to go in search mode, I have to press I, okay, and then I can type, or you can press F. In this case, the I'm already here, okay, but it could be, for example, if I press, yeah, right now I'm out, okay, so if I, I'm not here anymore with the cursor, so if I press E and I try to insert, you know, it's, it's nothing is happening because the cursor is not here, but somewhere else, you know. So what you want to do in this case, you want to press F. By the way, you can click here with your mouse. Or you can press F and then again F, as you can see here. So it goes straight there with the cursor and it goes straight on insert mode. So right now I can search for Linux, for example. And there it is, searching with DuckDuckGo. You can do the same. DuckDuckGo is the default uh, search engine. If you press O, okay and then you type uh, whatever you want to search. If, if it's not, uh, by default it's a URL, okay, such as uh, google.com, okay, I'm not gonna type that anyway. But if there is no path, is there, if there is no uh, URL, okay, it uses DuckDuckGo to search. For example, I can search Arch Linux, okay, and as you can see, it search without the Go Arch Linux. I can do the same, but opening a new tab by pressing Shift and O, so capital O. And as you can see, it tells you open dash T for a new tab. And let's try to search Arch, Arch Linux again. As you can see, it open here a new tab. I can, uh, I can change the tab, I can switch tab by using the, the mouse buttons, the mouse wheel, by the way. And I also can do that by pressing uh, a, uh, J, capital J, and capital K. So Shift J, Shift K. Okay. And I can close one, one tab by pressing D. I can reopen that. In this case, uh, reopening a tab with undo, with the undo command, which is U. So in this case, the undo uh, command reopens that tab. Okay. So I'm going to show you that uh, it's some videos, audio, everything is working. So let's search for insert mode. Okay, what's going on? Bit shoot. Then I want to go there, H A. And then I want to search, or actually I just click some, some video here. And by the way, you can go up and down using the 
Oh yeah, that's why. Because my cursor is in here. I want to go here. You can go up and down just by pressing uh, uh, down and up or J and K and left, right by pressing left, right by the way and H and L. Okay, let's open a video here. Skull and Bones, nope. <laughs> Worms Clan Wars. You can see the audio is there. It's also the video. Okay, actually there is no desktop audio, no idea why here. All right, never mind. Anyway, the audio is working for me. Okay, so probably I have some problem with the connection here and everything. The default sound cards. Let me. Actually, maybe we can. Okay, never mind. Anyway, video is running fine. Audio is running fine. If you are on uh, i3, you can also go in floating mode. You know, go full screen. And then on full screen, you have your nice window with the video, you know, as you can see here. Very nice. This is uh, something for i3 user and any other tiling window manager. Anyway, let's go back. The last few stuff I'm going to show you. Uh, by the way, you can access all the command by pressing colon. And then you have all the commands. You can also check the k bindings here as i show you h capital h to go back capital l to go forward in this case i'm going to run ad block update okay and it just update the ad block by the way if you're running through a terminal you have all the info here what's happening what's not happening what's going on you can press minus and plus to change the zoom level you know and that's it there are many other uh, stuff that you can learn you know key bindings commands you can press help you can type help sorry let me set zoom level to 100 and then you have the the cute web browser help so the main page you can just go start guide quick start guide and here you have the basics you have a nice bindings image here you know cheat sheet etc and there are many other stuff here really a very nice browser it's very fast you know you can by the way modify all the k bindings you can create your own commands if you know how to do by the way and that's it so if you like vim like software if you like vim uh, key bindings if you like using more your keyboard than your mouse but even if you like just to to try something new just try it out it's there on arch linux no comp no compiling just you can install in a seconds in a matter of seconds and you can try it out all right hope it was helpful and clear enough and I'll see you in the next video guys bye bye